Hello and welcome to Tech Post. My name is Ravi Singh. And in this video, we are going to port two settings from the S7 Edge. Now, the first one is how to port those always on screen display on any Android device. And the second one is that Edge widget, which comes when you swipe at the edge of S7 Edge. Now, before going ahead, I request all the new viewers to please subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, because we upload similar videos and how to tech guides. So please subscribe. So without further ado, let's get started and let's see how to do it. So what we will be doing is uh, you can see when I double tap on the screen, it just wakes up the phone. Similarly to S7 Edge, this option is inbuilt and it comes preloaded. So you do you can s select the watch face. So we will be doing this on our another Android phone. I have this Lee TV phone. So what we'll do is we'll install on AMOLED application from the play store and then we will allow some permissions and once you're done with the permissions and access granting accesses just tap on the arrow and you will be taken to the main screen and if asked just install the plugin which is required now once it's installed simply go back and if it's enabled already you don't have to touch anything just tap on the play button and it will show how it will look like now you have so many options in this you can change the watch face and there are some extra settings like battery saver you can save your battery and you can uh, you know decide when to display this uh, always or when to turn on this always screen also you can select many watch faces which are which comes preloaded in this app now the main thing is you need to enable the accessibility service to allow this to work properly and the other option is you can enable pick to wake up or raise to wake up option so when you put your phone down it will not display always on and when you pick up it will just turn on the screen so here we are we can select any watch faces there are paid watch faces also so you don't need to select that just select the free version it's good and if you want to purchase you can go ahead and purchase one now the second uh, app to enable the edge widget on our android phone is iv so just install it and there are so many options to customize edge widget on your android phone so we have quick panel options, main panel options. You can add contacts, peoples, multiple apps, and even widgets. So I'll show you, you can even resize the bar on the left edge, or you can even, if you prefer right, you can take it to the right. And if you prefer left, you can take it to the left. So you have these options. There are no pro services. It's totally free for now. I don't know what will happen in the future. You can change the background colors. You can change foreground colors. You can change title colors. And even you can uh, set the transparency option or the size of the bar which you need to swipe. Along with this, you can add multiple apps also. If you want to choose a particular app to display in the edge widget, you can select it from uh, right there. The option is there. Just tap on the six dot menu and you can do this when you tap on any contact it will take you to the contact menu also you have option to you know read news through rss feeds from the popular news networks like fox news cnn and other tech uh, popular tech websites or whatever topic you want to read so i'll choose here some news channels and also you can as i said you can add widgets to it so to add widgets you have to go in under the widget option and select any widget which are available on your android phone so any widget which is already on your android phone you can add it to the screen and you can access it when you swipe the edge screen in the next video i'll also talk about this feature of swiping the edge to control your brightness of the phone or control volume system volume or anything related i'll discuss in our upcoming video for now thank you guys for watching this video i hope you really enjoyed it and if you did please consider subscribing to our channel and also like and comment down below share this video and i'll see you in my next video